What up, people? Leah here from Creative Tech Lab. Today, we're here to talk about audio and how to sync it up in Final Cut Pro. Let's get into it. But first and foremost, welcome to Creative Tech Lab. My name is Leo. This is a YouTube channel to accompany our website, creativetechlab.com, where we do talk about all things creative. But this is probably your first time here. The only thing that I ask is that you stick around, you give the video a chance, you watch it in its entirety. And then once you're done, if you like it, do all the things that YouTubers tell you to do down at the bottom with the buttons down below or just go watch another video because that helps us out as well. And today is also Thursday, so we're doing this three minute Thursday thing. But before we even get into the software, let's just talk about a few things. So like right now in this room, this is not my typical setup. My typical setup is outside this room, but because everybody is home or we're working from home, I can lock myself in this room, but it's really echoey, hence I have the lav mic on. I actually hate lav mics because they pull down my shirt and look all funny and I don't really like it, but we gotta do what we have to do in these particular times. So I'm running audio into the lav mic and I'm also running audio into the camera, um, but because the lav mic is closer to me, the room isn't as echoey. But that means I have two separate audio sources. So the very first thing that I do is I come into the software, I turn on the camera with this audio, I make sure I have audio running on the camera and then I make sure I have my audio running on the recorder and I say audio on, video on, and then I give it a good clap. This is not 100% necessary, but I do find like in multicam clips, it helps the software figure out like a matched up spike, a loud spike in the audio. This is also why people use um, the screen claps to sync up audio. So that just gives the software a good place to match up the audio from. So that's the very first thing is when I'm shooting, I make sure that I get a nice good clap to start. So let's jump over into software and then show you what that looks like. So this is super simple. I have this clip here, select, I command select this one so now I have both clips selected and then I come up here to clip and then just hit synchronize clips and it comes in here. So this is where the sweetness is. You could just use automatic settings or you could do custom settings. This is your video if you wanna change your video um, resolution for any reasons which you shouldn't have to and then use audio for synchronization this is why it's important to have an audio source on the actual camera clip and then disable audio components on the AV clips this is going to take away the audio that is super echoey so that's if you want to do that if for some reason you want to keep your audio from the camera, let's say there was a particular room told me you wanted to keep, you would uncheck that box. But in this case, I want the cleaner audio from my microphone and then I want to disable that clip there. So then you do that and then boom. But yeah, it's that easy to sync audio in Final Cut Pro. Now syncing audio from just one single video clip to one um, audio clip is super simple and super straightforward there. That's all it is that you have to do. If it is that you want to do multiple camera angles with different audio, that requires a multi-cam selection where it is that you could do different cameras and different um, pieces of audio. It's a little bit more complicated, but three minutes is not enough time to cover all that. So that will be covered in another video. Anyway, if this video helps you out in any way, shape or form, please go ahead and drop it a like, hit the subscribe button and the notification button. That would be greatly appreciated, even though I'm not gonna tell you what to do, it's your life, live it the way that you want to. However, we do talk a lot about run and gun videography here on the channel, Final Cut Pro, iMovie, all that good creative stuff, along with a lot of other stuff here to come. Check out my other Final Cut Pro tutorials that I've done here, link up here and we'll be at the end of the video. Watch some of those while you're here, watch some of the other stuff that I've shot and I will catch you in the next video. Big up yourself, peace.